tonight as fire continues to, uh, fire crews that is, continue to monitor the fire at Notre Dame Cathedral in Paris. The French president said that France will rebuild and they'll ask for international help to do that. Here's what else we've learned in the last hour. Minutes ago, the prosecutor's office ruled, ruled out terrorism and arson for now. Hundreds of firefighters are still on standby. The fire commander said they're much more optimistic than they were just an hour ago. He added that two-thirds of the roof has been ravaged. One firefighter was hurt. Fire crews will be on the scene all night to try and cool that structure. 2031's Cody Fisher talked to a Huntsville family who is in Paris right now. He joins us now live from the studio. And Cody, what did you learn? Well, Dan and Naja, right now the Moore family has been uh, at and around the area of Notre Dame and the cathedral uh, all night. Now, this is an image uh, people from around the world will remember uh, forever. They're currently right near uh, Pont Saint Michel, which is a bridge close to uh, the cathedral. And the spire that fell, uh, if we can go to that video, the spire falling is what people will remember for. Uh, throughout history and right now that's what you saw um, right here on ABC first and you know they, they describe it as uh, the, the family the Moore family describes what you're seeing right now as an incredibly somber scene uh, with people singing hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of people um, uh, all, all of the uh, traffic has been uh, shut off to this area and people are getting out and walking the Moors are in Paris right now for business, but they took a few extra days to see the sites, and they actually went and saw uh, Notre Dame on Saturday, and then obviously this happened today. And they're going to be back in Huntsville tomorrow. Reporting live in the studio, Cody Fisher, Way 31 News.